This vlog is sponsored by Ana Luisa Jewelry. I've worked with Ana Luisa for so long now and you guys know how much I love them. They kindly reached out to me and sent me another few pieces of jewelry to review. So I had this gorgeous ring and earring set which are stunning. They are currently running a sale with 15% off all products starting from April the 12th. I know that it's Mother's Day soon in America and elsewhere across the globe and these gifts will be perfect for mothers everywhere or yourself and the discount is amazing. The quality is stunning. I have a lot of their pieces at the moment and it, they just seem to last forever. It also arrived in this stunning packaging which is super eco-friendly and simple. The pouches are lush. I'm pretty sure they are non-tarnished pouches. The adjustable ring has to be my favourite simply because of not only the colour of the moonstone because it shines so many different colours depending on the light and angle but also because it is actually adjustable and I have super super ridiculously tiny fingers so the fact that this is adjustable means I can make it slightly smaller than average so it fits my little bony fingers and it just looks stunning when it's on. You can click the link below to receive 15% off everything in this shop. Thank you so much Anna Luisa for sponsoring this video. Now let's get on with the rest of the vlog. So I've just received some happy mail from Catnip and I'm going to open them on the vlog I thought. Oh, look at this cute little wrapping paper. This is her new wrapping paper. I didn't think she'd be using it to pack orders in. It feels really nice. Let's open this nice and carefully. Oh, look at this, so cute. So this is for my friend's birthday. By the time this goes out she would have received them. It's much bigger than I thought. Oh, it's so cute. And then I bought a bunch of stickers in her sale. Oh, this cute little card. It's adorable. Let's open these stickers. How does she pack them so neatly? Oh, and this little cute Satsuma cat to go with the stickers I bought for my friend's birthday. So I got some trash stickers because I always forget to take the bins out. And a bunch of home stickers. So this one is moving home. Um, savings and this one's just little cute homes and this one is mowing the grass because no doubt we'll all be mowing our grass very soon as the days get warmer and longer so yeah these are really cute i'm so pleased with everything
Good morning, welcome to another studio vlog. It is Tuesday, the 6th of April today, and I have a few things that I wanna get on with. So lately the shop has been really, really, really quiet, and that is never a good thing when this is my sole income. So instead of worrying about it too much, although I am worried, I have written a to-do list full of ideas that I've been wanting to try lately. So this is just a bunch of things that I just haven't been able to get around to because I've been so busy. So one blessing of being quiet is that I can get on with things that I wouldn't have been able to before. So for example, I've been looking at SEO a bit more and how writing blog posts can help. And I wanna develop my new card collection. I've done a few, one or two designs and there's a bit more that I wanna do there. There's gift wrap that I wanna do. There's things that I wanna upload to Redbubble but haven't had the time. I have a new stationery set that I want to release soon based on, I think I showed you these last time, but these kind of planners, which will be A5 size, so smaller than this. So this is the manifestation station. Don't know if that's a bit of a mouthful. Um, and then an extra one, which I think was like a reflection and focus on the year, which would be pink. And then I want to pop little crystals inside them as well. So they'd be like a nice little manifestation set for people that want to get started and kind of plan their goals and just yeah kind of beginners with crystals and stuff like that and I think look really nice so I'll be collaborating with a friend for that then I really need to update my design services section on my website which I don't think exists yet so rather than update the section I need to make the section so I get a lot of um I do a lot of freelance, but when the process isn't really the best, so I have people emailing me asking, oh, do you do logos? Do you do this? Can I have this? And I'm like, yeah, so I send over a Word document with um, loads and loads of questions that I can ask them so I know what they want. But there's nothing really advertising that on my website. I don't really have like a portfolio section. I don't have an inquiry form. There's nothing really like that. So I was thinking to really make a section dedicated to my design services and logo design and branding so that I can streamline the process a bit more. So there's that, that's, that's a kind of a big update though. Then I've written down vellum wrap. So yesterday I tried out some custom vellum wrap, which looks like this. So it's like tissue, but thicker and great. So a bit like tracing paper, but um, I can print on it. And I thought to make custom wrap. So this is like a little print that I've wrapped up. And yeah, it worked really well. So I was thinking of maybe offering this on my website so that I can print other people's um, packaging, tissue, whatever. Um, these are A4 in size at the moment. But if they do well, I might invest in A3 because I have an A3 printer. And I think most people who sell sort of A4 prints or bigger things would appreciate an A3 sheet instead. So that's my thoughts on that. And then for ages, I've made these custom easy peel stickers for my cards. I don't have an example right here. So on my greeting cards, I would have a sticker to attach the envelope and the card together. And this sticker peels off easily, leaving no residue. And I've made them pink and I pop my logo on them. And I get loads of questions asking where I got them from and if I could make them. But I've never actually got around to putting them on my shop or making them for anyone else. So I think it's about time I've offered those on my shop as well because I've Googled others and they're so, so expensive. Um, I don't have, I don't know why they're so expensive. So if I can make them for other small businesses and creatives at a lower price, yeah, so then I will do that for them. I don't know why they're so expensive everywhere. It's just, yeah. So I can do that. Then I just need to get on with emails and orders of which there's not many because the past week has been very quiet. I'm hoping to hear from the embroidery shop today, fingers crossed, because they will be showing me the samples of the two t-shirts designs, t-shirts? The two t-shirt designs that I've, um, planned with them. So one is the self care club and the other is the no lies, just fries. No fry, just fries, no lies. 
no no lies just fries that is it that's my favorite one so i'm hoping to hear back from them today i dropped off two t-shirts so they can proper place them and see how big everything is and yeah i just want to get started on t-shirts especially because it's been so warm this weekend um we went to a park a castle we went to the beach it's been lush and then it snowed yesterday so yeah so that's enough of me rambling with my plans. So let's get on with the day. So I've just been working on the custom vellum wrap you can see on my screen there and I printed some for the lovely Kaylee Moore designs so that looks like this just to test a bit more and have a bit um, a few more patterns so I could take some pictures to add to my Etsy shop so I've been working on the listing this morning adding all the photos in doing all the tags doing the descriptions the titles and I've just taken some more pictures of this one and then I'm gonna add them to my shop and see how they do so yeah wish me luck so I've added the new vellum wrap to my Etsy shop here and I've added loads of different options including a sample and have added all the new photos so I'm really happy with that let's see how it goes some music in the background. I've just been printing some more of the peelable greeting card stickers. So they look like this and they just peel off really easily and then I can pop them on my greeting cards like this. And then on the back it says I'm removable um, eco alternative to plastic packaging peel me and they peel off leaving no residue whatsoever and they're great because they keep the envelope and the card together. So I just printed out a bunch of them to put on my greeting cards because I haven't had any for a while. And I'm thinking of putting these in my shop for others as well. So they'll be personalizable so you can have your logo on them and some text. Because I get asked about them so often. I don't know why I've never put them in my shop, um, but today's the day. Like an old lady today when I was going on probably the hair and the, and the earring combo but today is Thursday and I've been working on uploading all those stickers and the new vellum to the Etsy shop so that's all done now I had a three delivered yesterday of the vellum wrap and it printed amazingly I don't have an example to show you because it was for my friend Kaylee Moore designs and I already dropped it over to her house so she has that herself now but the a3 looks Fab. it prints amazingly I'm so glad so I'm gonna add that to the shop today and I've just been working on um, branding projects so I can't actually show you any of those because they're just they freelance projects that my clients haven't even seen yet but I'm excited to get on with a bit more of that that's the beauty of my job I guess it's different every single month although sometimes I can feel stuck in a rut and then something else comes along so I'm just gonna be get on with those today and yeah, looking forward to the weekend.
it is now four o'clock and I am clocking off early for the day because I usually finish around 6 p.m. So today I'm having an early one. I'm going to relax for the rest of the afternoon, ready to start a busy day tomorrow, which is Friday. So hopefully I'll be really busy tomorrow, fly through my to-do list and then chill on the weekend. So I just go back from the embroidery shop and I've picked up the t-shirts which are behind me and I'll show you them now. I'm so pleased with how they turned out. So this is the Self Care Club. I love the colours, they look amazing. And then we have the No Lies, Just Fries. I think this one's my favourite, just because of the cute little cheeky face. So these are both a size small and they fit amazingly. The quality, they're like quite thick t-shirts, but not too thick, so they'd be perfect for spring and summer. So I think I'm gonna list them on my shop as pre-orders. Yeah, so I'm thinking of doing pre-orders for these rather than a Kickstarter. I did a Kickstarter for the jumpers because it was completely new territory for me. I wasn't sure how they would sell, if they would sell, if people would like them. It required a lot of research um, into manufacturers and, in, and the embroidery shop that um, I've worked with quite a lot now. So I'm pretty comfortable and confident in the process. So I'm thinking pre-orders is the way to go for these t-shirts. Plus these jumpers are super hard to get hold of because of everything going on with COVID and everything in the world right now. But the t-shirts, I know if I order them, they'll arrive tomorrow or the next day. Whereas if I order these in, they could take a few weeks. So I'm thinking pre-orders. And then once everything, hopefully they sell, um, I like them, I'm gonna wear them. So I hope that means other people will like them and wear them as well. So once I pop the pre-orders in my shop, maybe today, I don't think I'll get around to it today, maybe next week, and then have them ready for say a week or two later. And then I'll have the rest of the stock in my shop and they'll be up on my website as normal to purchase. So yeah, exciting. Friday afternoon about half five I think the time ten to six and I was just sat here foiling away foiling all my stickers and then I had a migraine come on so I've just I'm feeling fine now by the way I just took myself away lay down in a dark room um drunk two glasses of water because I realized I hadn't drunk anything today I'd been so busy all I had was a mocha this morning and a cup of tea and not much for lunch. So this is this 
quite unlike me, but it's been a very busy day. So this is your reminder to drink some water and look after yourself. So I'm just gonna finish up with foiling for the rest of the day now and relax on the weekend. Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday today. I don't know why the camera is a bit dark, but it's a lovely day. I had a bit of a stressful, a stressful weekend just in regards to tax, mortgages, boring adult stuff that is very, very stressful. So I'm thinking now maybe that's why I had the migraine on Friday. Just stress that I didn't realise was there in my subconscious, but it came to the it came to my conscious over the weekend. Um so I'm just sorting things out. It's not fun, it'll get sorted. Um apart from that, I have three potentially three, definitely two very exciting branding projects um, on the go. Um, so I'm very, very, very excited to start those. Uh, one is for a pet accessory company and they want a full branding project. So I am so excited to start that. It'll be everything from the logo to the social media, to the stationery, to stickers and everything in between. So I'm really excited to start that, but I can't show you guys anything before I show the client and it's all approved and everything. So today I'm gonna to be working on the mood boards and the color palettes and everything. And um, I guess just tie up bits on Etsy. So yeah, let's get on with the day. So I have just had an exciting delivery, which I think is from Cosmic Design Studio. So let's just open this up. Look how nice that packaging is. This is so exciting. Oh my gosh. Look at these. So I'm not sure if I've told you guys on this video yet about my plans for the manifestation um, stationery sets and I thought it'd be nice to include a little bag of crystals with each one so you can manifest your dreams. Oh my god the bags are stunning. So in each of the bags if we open one up so we have four crystals in each bag and I selected the colours so that they match the stationery sets nicely as well. So we have lovely pink rose quartz. I'll need to have a look and check with Cosmina what each crystal means, but I think this one is about love and self-love. We have a lovely purple amethyst, which I think is for relaxing and being calm and aids with sleep. And then we have a beautiful clear quartz. And I think I might pronounce this one wrong. Selenite, maybe? I'm not sure. But look, it's like a little cute wand. I just think they are stunning and will look so good in these stationery sets when I have them. Hopefully, I'll have them by the end of the week. So it is almost 9pm, I just got off a lovely Zoom chat with my Patreons and I'm just about to switch off for the night and relax and make myself a lovely hot drink and just switch off and play Animal Crossing. <laughs> Good afternoon guys, it is Wednesday and it's about two o'clock now. 
and the day has just flown by. I almost forgot my hair appointment this morning. So I flew up to bed and drove down to the um, hairdressers five minutes late, but I made it. Completely forgot with so much going on lately. Um, yeah, so I had it cut and coloured for the first time, I think, ever. I don't think I've ever coloured my hair properly. So this will take some getting used to because half of it's gone. Um, but yeah, so I just got back and I need to just um, focus on the client work that I have going on. So the just the branding projects that I can't show you yet, but I'm going to be working on those and get on with some emails and admin work and just general bits and bobs. So as I can't really film much today, I'm going to end the vlog here and just start editing it and popping it up hopefully by the end of the week. So I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to my Patreons. You're all amazing. And I'll speak to you soon.